Uh, I mean, I don't feel too different about it. The only thing I only, I'm always a hard critic of myself, and um, good players can't miss free throws. So, with that being said, if I want to be as good as people talk about, I gotta make free throws, um, make the game easy for myself and for others. You know, even though they're just free throws, I mean, it's important to me. So, um, that's my biggest critic for today. Okay. All right. Thank you, Kelsey. Thank you, Kelsey. Um, you know, from the start, did you get kind of get a sense that your shot was maybe off a little bit? And if that was the case, uh, did you put a further onus on yourself to be more of a distributor out there? Uh, just trying to uh, diverse the game in many ways. Um, when one thing is not working, you got to try something else. So yeah, to answer your question, that was the case. Uh, probably a couple weeks off. The couple weeks off in between games kind of have a yeah. little impact. Yeah, definitely. Um, you're in that game mode, you get that. You don't get that first win until about four or five minutes in. Your heart, your chest is pumping. Your heart is going. Um, once you kind of settle in, that's when things start to get rolling for you. You're back comfortable. When your shot wasn't going, how much did you know relieve you when you saw Steffi have a big game? You have uh, the rest of your team really step up and have big games, especially off the bench. Well, it was very important to me. Um, um, winning and being successful in the NCAA tournament comes from a group effort. Um, it's not about any one individual. And uh, with that being said, it's always good to see everyone putting the ball in the room, playing the game on both sides.